Good day everyone and welcome back for another stream. Hopefully you're all having a wonderful day wherever you might be. So, yesterday I did a bunch of building, a lot of, mostly waiting though. I've organized my lines here, so all my supply lines are like evenly spaced, which is kind of nice to save me space later on. Um, got some batteries and stuff, we, our power armor finished researching, uh, the Mark II one, and I decided to get deficiency modules 3 because we needed to get that eventually anyway, kind of. Um, speaking about the modules, we still waiting a lot for the, um, a lot of them to build. <laughs> we've got all the level 1s, we've got full chest of them, I'm just trying to find them. Here they are. They're all here. For the level 1 at least. And then for level 2, we're getting there. These are done. These are done. This is all still going. <laughs> so obviously we've been using a lot of circuits and stuff, advanced circuits. Um, I think we're going to need to find more plastic. We might get some more iron because we're still waiting for stuff to build and catch up. But first, before I do that, I do want to upgrade my armor. So we're going to need 60 processing units. I need... Let's add an order for that. Uh, gee, can I have more space? Actually, I can. Wow, okay. So, 60 of these. Let's make it 60 exactly. I suppose it doesn't matter. Eh? I could automate this, but I'm not going to do that at the moment because, well... I mean, how many times have I needed to craft my armor, right? Electric engine units, 40. Um, there we are. Low density structure, speed modules, and efficiency mod modules. How many of these do we need? Because these stacks, the stack of these is 10, I think, for low density structures. Okay. There we go, I thought so. And then some of these. And some of that. Cool, now we just need to wait for our order to come through and then we can build the armor ourselves. Another thing I did try is I tried to put the requester chest on the side here and then have them insert stuff. But then they automatically just take them in and put them in here and then put them out again. So that didn't work. Which kind of sucks. I guess I'll just have to put them in machines manually some way? I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, we're probably gonna need more iron. I think we were running a little low last time I checked. It's a long way, damn. <laughs> this is why I need better armor, so I can get exoskeletons and more exoskeletons in here. Oh yeah, this thing. So it comes some more um, iron, but we want that to be constantly filled, as much as we can at least. So we're going to need to find some more iron to the right of our map. Which I think we have. Um, I'm sure I saw some earlier. Oh, there we go. There's six million there and a million there. Okay. Or we could just go up here. That's another alternative. Um, yeah. That'd be fun. Where's our tank? Um, I was playing around with it earlier. Yeah, uh, here we go. It's actually quite close. I don't even need to drive. I'll just leave my car here. 
Sidestep just calls around randomly. But first we need our power armor. Also, I should probably manufacture some exoskeletons while I'm at it. Because these guys are just delivering iron from my um, storage chests. I was obviously just really full before, which is why they haven't bought it yet, but obviously now there's a shortage, it's coming through. Not like we need iron ore in storage, right? Uh, I should have brought the car, damn it. Ooh, no, here we are, we've got our order. Okay, cool. Let's just cancel this now. Come on, finish! <laughs> My word, I'm excited about this. Oh, these, I need to change to level 3 modules, yeah. <clears throat> oh, we actually got level 3 production. Oh, wow, we do. Productivity, I mean. Woohoo! Equipment grid size 10 by 10. Okay, so we actually need to change our UI size quickly. Because they... Yeah, the game doesn't work too well with big U um, a big UI. So... Yeah, no, this, this is... Let's put this on my body. There we are. Hell yeah. Okay, so these... These personal batteries. Oh wow, I'm a lot faster now. Where am I? Oh, uh, I just ran out of power. Um, run. I've got some personal portable solar panels on me. I mean, producing. Um. Put my energy shield on. Also, I'm pretty sure I made some batteries. Um, there we go. Haven't tried them out yet. Woo! Um, I hope that's enough for now. And then we want the belt immunity. If I can find that. Belt immunity. <clears throat> oh, it's already in there. Never mind. Um, what else? I think that's it. Let's throw this away. Same with these. We don't need that. Um, and for now, I guess we just fill that with solar panels. <laughs> Maybe I'll add another two batteries, I don't know. I'm not sure how many I actually need. And we should probably do some whoops, research too. Yeah. We added like another two or three exoskeletons, oh my word. Whoa, that's a normal chest, why is that there? Let's just take a stack of 20, put it in. Woohoo! So, um... Research. Hey, let's see, I don't even know what I need. Um, cargo size might be good. What about... Oh, mining productivity. Sounds pretty cool. Okay, let's get that so long. Um, how do we craft them? What are the exoskeleton 
steel plates, processing unit, and electrical engine units. Okay. So, steel plates. What is coming up here? Oh, right. batteries, of course. So, steel processing units, electrical engine units. So, this is at the top. <coughs> Yeah, these are just a pain to build now, so I just get my bots to do it, because my goodness. It is a massive pain in the ass. I mean, it probably make more sense to have my other belts that are going horizontally, to have them go underground, but... I'm fine. This is nice. I like the how nice and long it is, and... How showy it is. Um, steel, electrical engine units, processing units. So which ones are electrical engine units? These ones. Okay, so it's processing units next. Yeah, so my rules for these lines are at least two lines spaced between each belt. Um, for the most part at least. And I've kept four here just to make sure, just in case I do actually run out of space. I don't think I will, but if I do, at least I'll have a bit of room to move around in, right? Oh, this is wrong. I mean, it's not wrong wrong, it's just wrong. Yeah, if any of you guys are interested in my thoughts about this. Which you probably aren't, because you probably got a better idea anyway. <laughs> Still missing 411 speed module level 3. Um, oh, I also, I, I think I showed you guys yesterday as well. We got some more nuclear reactors, eh? I built some more speed turbines, or turbines, or whatever they're called. I haven't automated them yet. Um, also, there's some weapons I wanted to test out. Not many. But I think it'll be fun to check it out. And I want this to build quickly. Um, so, so, I've been using grenades for a while. But now we've got cluster grenades somewhere. I know they're not going to do too much at this stage of the game, but I thought it'd be fun to try them out. And I've also got these poison capsules. So we'll get a hundred of them. And some slowdown capsules. I think I automated them both. I hope I did. <laughs> so I haven't tried them out yet. I just automated them so they could start building. So the exoskeleton was actually also automated robots as well um, down here. So now we're getting construction robots and logistic robots. Well, we will eventually one day when all of this stuff comes through. Um, exoskeleton. Steel processing, so it needs a lot of electrical engine units, okay. So I put steel and the processing units in the same line. The steel and processing units are this, okay. And then these will have to be on the outs or the inside track. In place. It's probably going to place this and copy. Um, this should be fine. So these are going to be on the outside. I won't power it just yet, and that way we should be fine.
Um, have I got enough power in my suit? No. 41% only. Wow. I'm just going to chuck in more solar panels. <laughs> Why the hell not, eh? And I can't wait for the new running speed, my word. My robots are taking forever. I suppose that's one real big disadvantage of having a really big base. If your robots are just... Oh, my word. They take their damn time. They're not like speed thing. Why have we already researched all of it? Oh, speed four. Ooh, that's next, definitely. Don't want to cancel and waste this research. I don't know if it does get wasted, but I don't want to risk it. And then also, I was thinking about expanding the base, like upwards here, then across here. Because, why the hell not? <laughs> or maybe it might be better from like here to go up here. So first I'll go vertically, and then maybe horizontally a bit. Oh, yeah, some of my trades have been getting attacked as well, um, while they're waiting. So I've also come up with a new design. Or substations to like look like this with all the turrets around them. So I'm gonna start placing those in my like, key areas where I really need them. I did destroy a few nests just because they were really close to my rails. But at the moment things look okay. Some of my trains did break, which sucked. So I didn't really notice in time. Like you're not broken, right? You're just waiting for this guy. Yeah. What are you waiting for? 90 seconds? Sure. He's got plenty of copper. Oh yeah, that's another thing I did. I got this copper vein down here sorted out. So now, yeah. We're getting stuff. <laughs> I think I do want to do as well. I want a bit of radar around here. Like, hmm. Actually, I could do that now on the map, eh? I could just find a radar somewhere. Um, come on, awesome does. Yeah. So, here is about central. If you put one here, should be fine. It's not a really nice thing about having radars, you can just build from your mini map. Like me, not even a problem. Also got a bit of a blank spot here. Don't want that. Anyway, have I remember to this stuff yet? Yes. Oh my word, I'm excited. I mean, these take a lot of resources, but man, are they worth it. Holy moly. Got our cluster grenades. Oh man, I want to try that out. Oh, we got four already. Wow. Okay, so. Where's our battery capacity? Is it going down? It's at 80%, it hasn't even filled up yet. <laughs> wow. So we're gonna need one of these, which means... Can we force one in? No. Yeah. I wanna see, okay, let's first try four. Woohoo! Am I losing energy? No, that is good. Let's try five. Holy moly, that's fast. 
532. That's ah, still going up. Awesome. And I think I still got space for one more. So now, obviously, if we do this, one, two, three, four, five, that, this is going to strain. Yeah. So this seems to be the magic number for now. Five. Yeah. Now let me change my UI size again, so you guys can see properly. Even though I'm not, I've zoomed out a lot more than I supposed to. That's probably more exoskeletons I'm ever going to need, but oh well. Uh, being wasteful and producing a lot more than you need is what you need, right? I could have night vision. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I don't know. Night vision is just so crap. Wee! <laughs> Look at these legs. Awesome. Okay. Do you have a car? Yes. Let's go. Go drive to our tank. So now I'm really happy about that. Now while we're waiting for our research, we're going to just expand our borders a little bit. Actually, whoops, before we expand borders, we should probably get more oil. Which we have everything we need for it, I think. Rails, yeah, okay, cool. Is there power armor Mark III? That'd be awesome. But I'm just being greedy now, aren't I? So I did actually look at a nice oil thing over here earlier. It's 1303. I mean, it's not the best, but it's better than all the other, other alternatives that are close by. I mean, that's a really nice one, but wow. That's going to be woo, fun to get to. Okay, let's destroy this next. This is really close. Don't like that. Ah, oh, crap. If only I had an exoskeleton on my tank. I found out the big biters have trouble getting you to go at angles. I mean, I get you still, but not as much as they should. And then again, maybe I'm just lying. I don't know. Give this guy a hand. Yeah, as you can see, those big biters, our evolution is 96%. So they're becoming quite an issue. And if they attack my base here, yeah, I'm going to be annoyed. Oh, I haven't even tried the plastic grenade yet. Um, I'll try those now. I want to see how useful these are. Not as useful as I was hoping. Uh, where's my slowdown capsule? That should help. Oh, that's rocket fuel. <laughs> I need to do my hot bar. Oops. Okay, wow. So, what do we not need here? Like that, we can just use our inventory. That we don't need because they're quite useless now. What the hell's that? Oh, my robots. 
pest grenades. We want to try that. Poison capsule. That's probably going to be useless, so yeah. Um, also, I don't really need concrete, do I? I will put my cliff explosives there. Oh, my ra rails. That's what I wanted there. Kind of. Okay. So this is the poison capsule. Let's try the grenade. <laughs> okay, that's fun. <laughs> okay, I gotta admit, that's pretty fun. Did it poison these mother truckers? Let's slow them down. Oh, that's good. That's really good for driving, though. Like, I can just use this and go around and attack their base and get it wiped out. What's wrong? You don't like being on the side of the goo, is it, eh? How does it feel to be slowed down? Mother truckers? Okay, so the poison capsules, pretty useless. But the slowdown capsules, holy moly, I wish I had them earlier. You still got fuel, right? Let's give you some more. So they do have to like actually be in the area of effect when you shoot it. Which makes sense. I was hoping I just had to run into it. Kind of like a fly trap, I think. Like, even like the worst situations now I can get out of. Wow. Like driving to a cliff? Oh, that's fine. You know, the upgrade we need is to damage, increase our rocket damage or explosives damage. Wow. At the moment, it's pretty crap. Is there still a nest here? Did, did this just get formed now? possible. So probably going to keep like 200 of these on us. They're just that good. Um, these we don't care about anymore. Let's trash that. Oh my, that's not good. Okay. <laughs> 